All right, how's it doing, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We are continuing our journey with Iwai Hime. We're playing the uh, presumably the third part of the series. Uh, well, we're gonna find out what is in store for us then. Uh, in the meantime, I, please. Hold on a second, I, I'm gonna get myself a drink. <laughs> Should I prepare this? Okay, let's go. I even brought myself some fried meat. <laughs> Load the third arc. Uta Hime Uta song. I, I can even tell that, that, that how that translates. Uh, oh, this is a magical soldier bullshit. Apparently, it looks like it. So, here we go. Two, one. There you go. Yes, 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 please. <laughs> My sparkle magic. I'm gonna make all your homes squeaky clean. Cleaning princess. The heck is going on now? Is this the no 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 kawa? No 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 kawa. Some the the other girl from the club. Another Alice in the Wonderland stuff? Apparently. Oh, really now? Just like the first and second part, they introduce us with uh, what this art is starting off with, you know, who the characters are involved. I just noticed that I didn't really like that stuff. So this is a not magical soldier stuff. More than that, it's like the magical idol stuff. Hmm. Idol master. Huh? That's not a bad anime too. Just not my thing, but 
even though I am a music lover, as a music standpoint, I don't really like the Taiyo show. Hmm. I felt everyone's eyes on me as I walked. Okay. Where is the everyone? Hmm. Oh, is this is from her perspective. Okay. Do, 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 do. I don't know how many hours this is uh, this recording gonna be though. Yeah, she's one of the clubs. Uh, the the other one that starts with an N. Just can't remember her name. I mean, I can't remember shit when the when the whole arc ended that way. I can't remember jack shit. <laughs> I don't remember how the fucking thing ended. Uh, okay, so. Uh, so where this is gonna lead us to? How is everything gonna tie up to that doll anyway? I'm still curious about that, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's not right. Yeah, I know how you feel, baby. I know how you feel, lady. I really do. But that's how most people treat us anyway. Oh. Near the infirmary. Yeah, she doesn't know. Hmm. Oh, multiple bands. Oh, something new and wonderful was about to happen. Sure. At least it didn't. I mean, the first five minutes doesn't turn to be a dark. I guess this is probably one of the light-hearted ones. Viria. Oh, it's not. Viria. <laughs> Obvious reasons.
Chill the fuck down, dude. And as for the stands for student, Suzumu doesn't give a flying fuck and doesn't know who she is. Let me guess how it's gonna go. Since, okay, obviously she's very popular, on this little oddball here, being the outsider who just dropped in this year, had no idea who she is, is the only one who's gonna treat her for her instead of, her, of the idol that she is. And then she's gonna stop falling for her. Falling for her. You're not even speaking a language that anyone can understand right now. Chill. ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
There you go. Well, he lived a very strict life, remember? Martial art training, after school stuff. And he's now like trained to be a man of his own, living on his own. Under your family's care, apparently, but I don't think you can have any time to actually watch this dance. Probably heard of it, but Slightly different now, ain't it? Oh, but you know, it's still gonna lead to what? To what? The same thing that I'm thinking of, that I was thinking about, right? Like out of nowhere? Seriously? No music, no nothing, just that's it. What the heck? Like what the heck? Sorry, kind of know what it's coming. I think he meant, which one are you? Are you that magical, magical girl on TV? Are you the student of this school? Or just someone who wants to find out who you are. No, I don't think there's any malice behind it. Lydia, 
ここでは布川リリアって名前なんだ Yeah, that's what he was asking. Which one are you? I don't really get it now.、Uh, was that some form of interpre-、uh, her internal thoughts throughout the entire process?、Uh, I guess. Because Guria is going to be both, right? Simple answer, but okay, it works. Really, I can't. Yeah, her demeanor changed as well. Like、to know that too, please. Maybe you could use your strings to actually pull up more information about his background and his past. <laughs> I don't know. Seriously. He's not even making any sense anymore. We lost him. He's lost. He's done for. He's just done. Yeah, I bet it is. You have a problem, you know that? She has a massive problem. A massive, huge identity crisis problem. <laughs> What, she wanted to be like, she was just with someone with long hair, and people start thinking she wants to start thinking about having,、uh, growing up her hair. And now she sees this, and now she wants to be like, what? What, what is this? Kiko chan wa, ima no mama da te, make nai kirai ni kawaii yo. Hmm. Oh, really now? Okay, okay, I, it's still leading towards the way I was thinking about it, but okay, okay. I would love to see that, yeah. I would love to see that.
Mm. I wouldn't know about that, but. Okay. Another charity stuff. Hmm. I see. Okay. I I don't know. I can't really understand the karma stuff anymore, especially after that two arcs that we went through. <laughs> Not in this world. Okay, she's a star, a superstar, and a very high ambitious um, idol, I guess. Check as well, yeah. Jeez. <laughs> I mean, I need more. I need to know more about her. What the hell is her problem? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah.されなくてもいい。ただ同じ空気を共有できるだけでいいんだ。yeah, that 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 sounds a little bit gross then. まあ、リディアンの迷惑にならない程度には、こう綺麗な方がいいと思うよ。ですよね。私も見たしなみをしっかりして、お掃除でハッピーハッピーハッピーしなきゃ。アイドルデビューのチャンスはいつどこにある
she needs a lot of mental health. <laughs> she needs. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. <sighs> We're right back to this entire whole thing. そんなことないです。チャンスなんて本当に些細なことからデビューに繋がったことがたくさんいますから。Well, really has an identity crisis. I'm learning more about her, I just I want more. I want to know more about her now. We already know that this caterpillar is in a, living in her own imaginary world. ハイスクールってダンスがキレキレだからな。ああ、でせてビリビリ。なるほど。それでリリアちゃんもダンスレッスンが欠かせないわけだ。あんなに踊れるんだからよっぽどレッスンしてるんだろうね。お稽古頑
Yeah, I don't, I don't get it. What was with Japan and Korea with idols? すごいんだね。武道館とかで歌ったりするんだ。今はライブハウスがメインです。武道館もいつか行きたいですね。うん。オッケー、オッケー。秋葉娘とか桃色組エースとかなら聞いたことあるよ。Okay, that's now that's just I guess that. Okay, okay. Kurus Lydia, the Dare Genosin Shirane no Kayo Susara. Great now, my Rashkuneze. Also, the princess magical Lily, the Shirane no Kayo. Terebi at it all. Terebi, I'm Marie Minaikarana. でも、秋葉娘とか桃色組エースとかなら聞いたことあるよ。おいおい、そんなメジャーどころと比べるなよ。リリアちゃんの入ったフラワーハイスクールってのは身近なアイドルをテーマにした。ミニマムさが売りな
I mean, she's pretty much egoistic, though. High ego. I guess it's your ego. That's what's wrong with you. <laughs> So we're now playing the perspective of this girl more than we were playing with the perspective of this guy when we first started. Okay, interesting. A complete reverse of how Suzumu can't get uh, Urokami out of his head. In a way. Different bath tiles. Or well, more of a shower. Looking at one right here. I don't. Very logical. That's what most people would do. Because of fear of the unknown, and you start to hate, and they start to discriminate, and they start to bully the that started off the bully, the the abusement, everything. The fear of the unknown. No, oh, it definitely was. <laughs> She has to find out because she wants to know now that she has the same inquiry he has towards Kurokami when first. Okay, this is the reverse. Okay, this one, he's the popular guy. She's the popular one. And this guy is just the oddball that just happens to be around and everybody knows. <laughs> But I'm pretty sure it's just the ego that's kind of got hurt. The pride of the idol side of her, you know, that she's proud of. Yeah, 
Yes, probably. Yeah, it's like I said, it started to lead towards what I was saying about how this situation is gonna go. She start falling and she start finding that this guy looks her as her and not some idol or some popular stuff. Let's try to see her for who she is. And apparently she doesn't seem to have an idea who she is. When he, she, he asked her that question, you know. Who are you? Mm-hmm. Green hair, violet eyes. Pretty, that's actually pretty. Oh, I just noticed that the these decorations here is actually different. More flowery and leaves. Did that change? throughout the entire series or throughout this things I didn't realize I had to look back at the second art because I remember what the first art is yeah she hasn't had any prices yeah, yeah so this flower Yep, that's the eagle talking. To hear that, yeah. yeah, you better move yourself to the music, you know, the moment you go on it, and you never ever let it let it go. You, know? you only got one shot, do not make the chance to blow. This opportunity comes in a lifetime. You know? <laughs> Oh, 
okay. That's dedication right there, you know. That you should be proud of that. I can understand why she'd feel a bit pissed when someone doesn't even know her. Um yeah, because she probably did a lot of stuff already. Reminded me of another a different set of flower. Wait, that's not good. It's beautiful. Ah, <sighs> really, uh, like an angel. She definitely has some like that crisis as well. I see. Nice camera bending. start seeing it yeah 
she still see herself as this small little child that she's growing up. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna haunt her, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, it was the ego. Then leave the damn company then. They just see you as an item then get the hell out of there.
3年間押されて自分と環境に折り合いがついて That's great determination right there. And I salute that she did not go all, all to what this agency who only sees them as an item and a uh, sexual object. And she denies that. That's obviously good. There you go. I was right. Taking her as her, not as some idol, not some, uh, not some um, magical girl. No, just her being her. But that has a determination, and that has a that has a goal in life, and striving towards it. So yeah, I was right. It is leading towards it. It's nice. It started off with a different vibe. The, well, not really different vibe. But an opposite vibe of how he was feeling towards Kurokami. But it, 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 it ended up the same way. Hmm. So yeah. Yeah, she starts to understand it. It's more she gets closer to him, then like she's gonna start to understand it. That since he doesn't watch TV, which is very weird for her. Oh, uh, I don't watch TV too, so, but not watching TV and not focusing on the entertainment is, uh, aspect of life is doesn't mean that he doesn't. It's not aware of it. It's just that. Um, he just wants to accept people for who, who they are and what they are and move on with his own problem, you know? Live with his own problems. Yeah, he just doesn't get involved in it. She took it as a challenge. It's somewhat like falling in love. In a good, uh, in a good way, actually. <laughs> now, even if she did, he's not going to fall for her as a celebrity. He's only going to fall for her for her and the person. It's really uh, not, not some. Hi, uh, flower high girl uh, group idol, not some magical girl who used to be popular now. Mm. Yeah, it is leading towards that. So, so, 
<laughs> yes, a little bit. That was just the ego talking. And it's still slowly leading towards it. With less interaction than I thought it would be, but it is still leading towards it. Nah, you're just at a stage. You're always all that way. Teenage life. Okay then, that's that's the first hour, and uh, for once, nothing bad happened. For once, the first hour of the game, nothing bad actually happens. Actually, it turned out pretty normal. I guess this is like the light-hearted uh, arc of the series uh, of the entire show. Still can't see jack shit on this picture though. I, in fact, it's much clearer when, uh, when the lights were a bit dim. Eh? Wait, what? Thank you for the lurk. Wow. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Why are you asking me? I have no fucking idea. Wasn't thick enough to be dirt. It's ash. It's ashes. Okay. Footprint. Bakabakashi. 
Excuse me. Well, understandable, but That does explain it, I guess. Huh? Uh, okay. But seriously, though, the whole. This whole place. Oh, now I see why I built this flower and this pattern looks familiar. Oh, God. It was pretty obvious, but I just didn't notice it. It's from the clothes that this thing is wearing. Ah, okay. Eh. Okay. Okay. First indicator of something weird is happening, but it's more light hot slightly lighthearted and less impactful than the last two. Because at the very least it took the whole hour to actually get to that tiny bits and pieces of mysteries. Uh, okay, but now we're on the Sunday. Meaning, and then you start uh, doing that less now. じゃあ、お掃除をしてる感じの何枚かいただきましょうか。お掃除ってこんな感じかしら。She's very determined though, that's 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 a good thing. Oh that has many many meanings, mister. is not wearing anything provocative. <laughs> I was worried about that. <laughs> She's gonna come back with her or something.
okay, okay. I did not expect that. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Good question, that's a pretty good question. Yeah, take action. Rather than just thinking about it, take the action. Yeah. Shoot him directly. Smart asshole. A very smart asshole. <laughs> He's a smart asshole. So, yeah, it's true though. When someone doesn't really think about it, he'll just give up answer immediately. When someone Ask them something like that. Anybody go man and woman, same thing. But when they actually start thinking deeply before answering, it, it, it does mean something. No matter how free spirit that you are, no matter how much of a serious person you are. <laughs> Even psychology, things that does bother your mind when someone asks exactly what is on your mind or you don't want to tell anyone you'll be thinking of how to answer it. It's just subconsciously happening to everybody. Anybody, actually. <laughs> yeah, because it hits the fucking mark, isn't it? You can use your popularity and uh, get his attention from here, you know? Just 
チェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッチェッマジカルリリーがこいよ。Okay, that 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 is getting annoying. マジカルリリーは大きくなったら俺の嫁になるんだ。誰の嫁にもさせん。創造シート。リリアちゃん。Yeah, she knows that no matter what, they're gonna write the, their own bullshit on it anyway. Obviously, they won't. Especially、uh, Natsu. I don't think Natsu is gonna leave you around. <laughs> Just find, find a sluggy looking person, you know. 
sweeping or you know wiping something wiping a rock or something <laughs> looking so disappointed and dead inside and then you'll find them <laughs> it's just how i imagine that zoo would be right now <laughs> they kind of like force him to be away from uh from uh, his uh idol <laughs> Fortunes, yeah, yeah, typical shrines, eh? gonna get a lower drop oh lower drops oh, i've been waiting for this go 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 another side best known of the internet previous teenagers all across japan the doll memorial hall dolls memorial hall Present. The wider frame, the original the wider frame with the dolls. Old dolls carry spirit within them a long time. That's an old belief, but that's kind of true. I remember somewhere when I was a kid, there was a lot of people telling, you know, don't keep dolls inside the house as well because. You know, same reason why people don't like taking photos because it's like take the spirits away, a piece of themselves inside it. Uh, it's an old belief, but I remember it's a similar thing. They're about dolls as well. Ah, I see, I see. So when they are too when they're too old to play with dolls, rather than thrown away because they believe that there are spirits inside it as you grow with them, instead of throwing them away, they put them on, left it on the shrine. That's that's pretty sad. If you if you see if you think about it, you know. To honor, I guess, to honor them, the dolls. I see, I see, that's why. Okay. That would be extremely creepy. Dude, if you ever walk into Toros R Us section, the Bobby doll section, and all the doll sections, right? Just along along the pathway. In that very aisle from one end to the other, you right know. When you start to look around all the doors and just just slowly walk from one end to the other. You can feel the creepiness of those dolls that you might think about, you know, one of them, one or two of them just like turning their heads, looking at you and us. Or just the eyes, you know. What? <laughs> well, well, duh. Most of them, I believe it's like 99% of them are Japanese dolls. The other 1% would, be, would probably be wooden dolls or straw dolls. Oh. Don't, no, I don't think straw dolls will actually. Mm -mm -mm. They don't keep those things here. Um, 
it looks look kind of cute. It's kind of okay. It doesn't really look scary. But I guess in a dim, dark room, yes, it would be scary. <laughs> yes, it does. It does. It really does. Yeah, it looks a bit. Double head. New York Times telling this Japanese local hotspot. This place will be on every single one. Just then, one of the dolls suddenly became as big as a human and stood up on its own two feet. Trying to look at his sights here, and I can't really see, but yeah, it's still the same one. Yeah, it's, uh, it's I guess it's this part of a dress. Yeah, it is this part of a dress. Hey, it's away. Uh, san. What are you doing here? Yeah, it looks natural. You're gonna get answered from this thing? Seriously? This is where you messed up. Now I just understand what the dolls get up from. It's from the shrine. And okay, yeah, obviously she's wearing a shrine garb, so this shrine has uh, something to do with what she's going through and how everything is ties to those these nightmares that we're, we're, we're witnessing. So. And I uh, still want to know what does she mean by corrupted?
I want to know that too. Trust me, Rick. Yeah. Uh, In a way, she's not wrong. Pretty obvious, yes. And this family seems to know more than than just being, uh, you know, as boomers with a uh, old cultural belief. Wait, how is he here and did not even see? So those red ones were just the front gate. This is the actual temple inside. And what the hell is this? As if, as if they're digging a hole. I'm not gonna get to go through, go through that word. No. I mean, I don't know how to react to that too because I'm not an artist. <laughs> Coolly defined position. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Is that even a word? <laughs> oh, God. Hmm. 
私これでも一応芸能人だってこと分かってもらえました別に疑ったことなんてないよどうかうんうんYeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure that he still has his mind stuck on Kurokami for the time being. Sorry, but that line was pretty much、uh, pretty too hard. Too hard, and I'm、uh, trying too hard. <laughs> well, good luck with that. My words to you exactly. <laughs> Man, this question is this guy asks is just way too. I'm gonna, it's gonna hit her way too hard. See, he's gonna hit you in the nail, the biggest nail in your face, you know? With the same question Who are you? 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 Yeah, but what are you? Mm hmm. Of course you do. Oh, or... 
クルス・リリアだったっけごめんね。ボンガラガッチャ。よー、メドーマー。はい、あんくん、バリアンくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、あんくん、Which is very good. Oh, is that nail is so huge hitting her in the head right now? Uh, well, I'm playing the third arc. But technically. Uh, uh, the third season, or, or no, not third season, the third,、uh, the third、um, character in the game. <laughs> And so far, nothing's happening. It's just,、uh, well, nothing's actually happening. It's just that the, this dude, well, our main protagonist, so and so main protagonist, is hitting the nails of a, a so called a popular idol that used to be extremely popular when she was young. And now she's trying to grow up, you know. Doesn't really live up to the, the kitty cuteness anymore. She starts being a grown up woman. It's always, well, it is a mystery horror, and that's more of my thing in visual novels. And I know this is pretty much safe to stream because the guy who made this are the same people who created Higurashi and Umineko. This guy is being hitting a Nails after nails after nails with his stupid questions. That literally is actually, yeah, it's kind of true. And she is now conflicted as heck on how she feels about this guy. Well, is, it, is, it, is she falling in love with him? Is she hating him? And she's now, but this guy is just asking, you know, are you being you or are you trying to be, to relive the life that you used to have? And it, yeah. Do you want to move on from Magical Lily and become Riria Kurusu? Or are you trying to you know, relive the life of this Magical Lily that nobody else,、uh, nobody actually sees it anymore? Because Magical Lily is、uh, when she was like 10 years old, she was still a kid, and then now、uh, she's a teenager. She's、yeah, uh, she grown up, she's a woman. And,、uh, There's no, that's not much of a cuteness of the chubby little pureness of that little kid.、Uh, inspiration is just gone anymore. And so she had to be her. And did she just want everyone to keep living with you even after she grew up?、Uh, what makes you think I play Genshin and Honkai? <laughs> I, I do love storyline game based game, but if it's,、uh, I'm more of a visual novel, I'm not much into the action stuff. Unless the story is like extremely good, you know, something like Persona, or well, I don't think anything can actually beat Persona. They're, they're just too perfect. <laughs> they're just too perfect in everything. <laughs> um, I mean, I don't, I don't care about、uh, archaeologist Mona. I mean, I play fighting games too. You know, if it has a good storyline, I play it. I, I mean, I stopped playing fighting games long ago, but then I found a, a, an anime based,、uh, a 2D anime fighting game that actually has a very intriguing storyline. And I was interested in the storyline. I started falling in love with the characters. And、uh, I started playing it and I enjoyed it. Even though I'm not good at it, I got my ass beat and handed to me over and over again. I spent over 1,000 hours in that game. <laughs> oh man, this guy is getting the nail that he's hammering on this,、uh, on this girl is getting bigger and bigger by the minute. And he doesn't even talk to her that much. He can't tell that it, it's just getting bigger and bigger. It's gonna annoy her so much. She's gonna be so annoyed to this. Because she doesn't know how she's feeling about this. She doesn't, she r e a l i z e s it, but she's just not admitting it. This is the true question that she should ask herself. And this guy is spelling it out. 
letter by letter, not just word for word, letter by letter. Natsu showed me what you used to look like. For now, yes, I am Riria in the game. And this arc, I am Riria in this game. So it is so cool to see, man. And for the past almost two hours now, nothing horrifying happened. Well, there's small hints, bits in here, and we are actually getting close to this um, doll's mystery. We are now in the shrine where the dolls originate, but there's no law was dropped. I thought they were going to drop a law about the doll, but, but apparently there is something tied to this shrine with this doll. So there's one hint that is connecting all the dots from all three arcs that I've been playing. First arc, we were playing as this guy. Second arc, we played as another girl. And third arc, we play as Lydia here. Yeah, Natsu showed me what you used to look like. Yeah, Magical Lily is like an 8-year-old, 10-year-old girl. You're almost 18 now. That's 10 years prior. You look absolutely nothing like that little girl. A detective like, yeah, you know, something like an ace attorney. Um, of course, ace attorney style that has no uh, voice line. I'm not much interested in it, but I still give it a shot once in a while. And But since I watch so many uh, streamers playing that game, I kind of spoil myself. <laughs> kind of spoil myself what the endings are. So I kind of, kind of, kind of spoil myself. I don't want to waste my time on it. The thrill of the entire, uh, the ending and the thrill of the investigation is lost because of that. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really into story based line games. So that's why I understand. That's why I push uh, Honkai and Genshin and into not do not play the game as a game. You know, I don't see the game as a game because it's more of an anime. Just like this right now, I'm playing what you call a game. I'm streaming a game, but it's basically a free anime that has less animation than a normal anime that you know. That's all there is to it. <laughs> you were cute. Oh, this, this one line. You, mm. It's not his fault. He doesn't watch TV, apparently. Yeah, even if it is an action-based combat, we only play it because, not because of the, this build is better than the other build, or this character is better than that. No, we don't give a flying fuck about that thing. None of us give us uh, uh, even a slightest thought about it. Until it really mattered, you know? When we, oh, we need to beat this bot, we need to find a way. And we discussed it among each other, which is the best way to do that. And then there is where the real meta player started to develop between the community. Not, they don't come from the guy who, I play a thousand gacha game before this. I'm going to make sure I can play this game too. No, none of it come from that. Me Hoyo games and Hoyoverse now are not meant for gamers. Were never meant for gamers. Their target audience were never gamers. They are casual peoples. Animes. The anime fan, the weebs, the otaku, the outcasts, the outliers, you know. The people that is ostracized from everyone else. The the one the one that usually got laughed at. The one that was usually the being the butt of the joke, you know. We are the ones that were tailored to this uh, Miho by Mihoyo. That's why we support them. That's why we start seeing them how they communicate with us more than the, any other game developers. Because when we play other games, it's not like I never tried. I, I'm a Battlefield fan. I like Battlefields more than Call of Duty. I play FPS games as well. But I don't see any other game developers like uh, anyone that created The Last of Us. Spider-Man, God of War. Yeah, Otaku Tech, uh, Otaku Tech saved the world. Because they make, because well, the CEO himself is like a weird ass. He's weird. He's absolutely weird. He's a big fan of Neon Genesis Evangelion. And uh, to be honest, uh, that was uh, like among the first few anime that I start watching. So I know why he likes it. <laughs> Uh, I also know how the whole thing started and how the whole thing ended. It's like all the bad stuff 
and yeah, it's a very weird anime to actually be enjoyed, and not it, that anime itself is not like for everyone. Not everyone can actually watch Evangelion and understand the whole concept of the the whole storyline, and that proves that how how intricate in uh, Hoyoverse is making these their games is not about the gameplay. It was never about that. They suck at it. To be honest, I can agree to every other content creator who say they don't know how to make a game. I would fully agree on it because they kind of suck at it. At times, they are so stupid. Even we, the non-gamers, would actually say, hey, this, this shouldn't happen. That shouldn't happen. We always come up that way. But in terms of the, how they create the story to be is so immersive, they made it much more better than any other gacha games that I played. Not just uh, not in story-wise. In story-wise, I'm, and I mean that in story-wise, made by because the gacha game started in Japanese, right? Uh, I played Princess Connect, and I know Princess Connect has an anime of its own. And as much as all the animation in Princess Connect is mwah, top tier, because the studio who made it is like god tier studios, and the voice actors are just as the uh, some of them are actually the same uh, voice actors as Genshin, but. They never get me immersed in the game to play the game. I just want to know what happens in the animation. That's all I wanted to know. And that makes the game not meant for me. Because I have to play the game and I don't enjoy playing the game. But the story is good. And But I can't play and play uh, find out the story more because I couldn't play the game. I have to put money on the game. It doesn't seem to be fun for me when I have to force myself or my wallet just to get through something, right? And But Mihoyo is slightly different. They, they just, why push it again? But dude, it, dude, it's perfect. It's perfect. I played it in on, on Anime Later. The story is so good. Otherwise, they will not make an anime out of it. <laughs> in fact, if that's the uh, if you want to call a waifu game, uh, how about Fate Grand Order? I don't even I don't even want to delve into those community. Get the hell out of there! Because seriously, Fate series, the anime, the story, the law is so damn deep. I think it's far more deeper than what Genshin is trying to do. But damn, they only have like ten characters and like ten thousand copies of each one of them. <laughs> and it's so confusing too. It's so confusing as well. Uh, you want to start with the Fate series, you're gonna die because you have to really start from the beginning. And and to start from the beginning, you have to ask the, the community that plays the game. And you're not gonna get a direct answer no matter what. It's just confusing. I mean, I played I play like uh, when I was using a, an iPhone. I was using a, an iPhone for a second-hand iPhone before I switched back to my old stuff. Uh, I tried Fate Grand Order, and I walked around the Discord. I, I, I it's not a Discord. I think it was a Reddit. I think it was Reddit. So I didn't have Discord back then. Uh, I just simply asked one question. It was the current banner that time. There was two sabers on a banner, uh, two banners of saber, and I just asked one thing. Which saber do I need? Because I, I know there's a lot of multiple version of that character. Which version do I need to get me through mid game? I got seventeen different answers from just seventeen different people, and all of them doesn't even lead to the same manner that I'm talking about. I was so confused, and I still didn't get my answer. I was like, "What the hell is wrong with these guys? They're not bad people. That when you ask them, they actually answer. I mean, okay, they're." They're okay. They're not all that bad, but I still didn't get my answer. It's like, okay, get the heck out. I don't think I should be involved in this game because the law is just way too deep. I don't I don't think I want to delve into that hole that deep. I'm out of there. So I stopped playing it. Like about two weeks afterwards, I just stopped playing it. I don't know what, I, I can't get through. I just needed to know which, it was in the current banner. I had enough, I have enough wishes to make some summons. But I can't tell. There was two saber or two banner, and two—they're all sabers. 
I just can't tell which one could help me carry through mid game. That's all. Through that's it. That's not what I asked. I was so, I was so not being it. That is and that all doesn't even lead to the same. Yeah. I, I just, they just got, got giving me out law on which this saber should work with this, uh, this character and that this build and only works with that build if you're fighting this enemy. Like, that's not my question. <laughs> That was my question. I just need to know. That's it. Totemo, totemo. I could have got you. Eh. Okay, we will try him now. But this triumph doesn't feel last because it's like a big crunch to the face. The adorable that he was talking about, the type that he was saying about this magical girl was, was the little girl, not her. Because that may have indication burn away. Yeah, I know, I'm the only one playing this game. This is not a very new game, this is not an old one. Uh, they have a DLC, but I. I don't think I want to purchase the DLC. Eh, I don't think I have the money to purchase the DLC anymore. And because um, the DLC usually has those extra loot stuff, uh, the extra gore, the extra loot stuff that may not be safe for uh, what you call streaming. And uh, that's what usually happens when the developer of a game like Visual Novel they tend to focus on the story rather than the, the 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 weirdos who thinks about you know big ass and titties. So they don't tailor to watch those people that, that much because that's not their main focus. They do sometimes do the LCs that contain those stuff, and I don't want to play that. Usually they does, but I don't know about this developer though. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have any of it because none none of his series that I know so far has ever had any loot. Well, nothing, nothing obnoxiously loot. Not like the one that I almost killed my own my own stream because of it. <laughs> well, even though it is bought from Steam, there was supposed to be uh, safe. The the whole gore, uh, the extra gore was cut off. The director's cut was left out. I have the full original one. I bought the second copy from Steam and I tried to stream it because I know that it was cut out. But uh, apparently Steam thinks of a 14 year old girl stripping off to her birthday suit and panning up to wet. It's okay to stream it. <laughs> I, I was like, I was shocked. I had to, I had to immediately cut this, cut the entire game cut the stream i mean change to a different game i was like oh my god i could have i could have been banned before i even started streaming <laughs> yeah you don't have the cuteness you're now a beautiful woman you you're not you don't have the cute anymore you don't have to act cute you're acting cute but that's just an adult look you just look like an adult acting like a child and uh, that's a bit weird for someone who doesn't watch TV, who just sees you as another person. It, yeah, it'll be awkward for them. <laughs> yeah, it, because it's the truth. Natsuko mo hito ga iyo ne. Lily no fan mo. Kimi o mite zetsubou shinai in da kara. Yeah. Yo, you had this guy is like, this guy is. Hitting her with a nail, getting that nail is getting bigger and bigger and bigger every minute. She is going to start hating him or something. And she's so confused right now. Is she falling in love with him? She doesn't even know. She just uh, can't get him off his mind, her mind. Technically, she starts thinking that maybe it is love at first sight. She is a teenager after all. I start to understand it, but this man perception on things. 
But what are you now? That's the question. And I'm pretty sure she, he didn't say this. Look at this. Look at this. It turned into 180 immediately. Oh, but at least it took two hours for the boy to start getting uh, to start pacing up. Man, she's actually turning into a beautiful woman, and that's it. And she sees herself ugly because she's still living in that past. Being that little innocent Ange angelic girl, little girl, you know. Even though she knows that she's an adult now. She's probably imagining him saying all this. Yeah, she definitely is imagining all this. And Mira shut it inside the inside a shrine. <laughs> Seven years of bad luck, baby. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's far beyond insulting. Maybe because he grew up, that's it. She's actually pretty. She's actually beautiful. Even her agencies, are, they're starting to see, you know, her as a sex, sex things, you know. Start to lure her into doing something more uh, towards the sexual, into the sexualized uh, idols. And she denies that, and I respect that. She defies those things. So okay. She doesn't see herself as beautiful. She doesn't realize how beautiful she is. She's like trapped in her own time and, and her own uh, popularity. Her fame. Yeah, it's so bullshit though. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, he was just at that age, insecurities, and, you know, identity crisis, ghost girls. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, probably drop by, huh? Dakara, Lily, you should go to school. Start to become a new person. 
Okay, man. Hey, I'll see ya. And you take care too. You have fun stream, man. And thanks for dropping by. I really appreciate it. Being Lily or just becoming a new you? That's a good question. That's a question. Man, this guy's, you know, the hammer is just not stopping now. You should chill and chill. Either one is fine because you don't really care. <laughs> is it? You can't choose both. She made that choice and stuck to it. That's hard. That's what I call dedication, and I respect that. I truly do. I mean, that yeah, they want someone that was willing to put push aside everything else just to make sure that one dream is uh, achieved in any in any form, and that's but still not going uh, doing it. You know, uh, surpassing the limits, knowing their own limit. Uh, not by not doing anything illegal. That's that's respectful. Yeah, deserves. Yes, she does. Trying to be the new you, but you're still using the old you too, by by still being the old you. That's how. It's, that's how. It's just not gonna work. If you're trying to change yourself. You have to leave the the old one. Well, not really leave it. You just really have to not bring the old one along with you. Create the new one. I guess this might be a small inkling of a struggle for young child actors. We'll probably have to go through this at at some point in their life and you know, we're probably handling it better or someone helping them to handle this. In her case, I guess she's doing it on her own. Which is still admirable. Yeah. yeah. Well, yes, one eighty another, but it's there's nothing scary about it. It's just mysterious. Dude, this thing takes shapes and form in day or night. 
and I guess that little mystery that I guess the those those things that I call the spirits are really like taking shit stronger in this inside the shrine. <laughs> I thought so. She was just inside the shrine. Yeah, obviously, but what the hell is this hole for? Please explain what is this for? Yeah, there goes the mystery again. That's her problem, the daydreaming, sleepwalking. Um, yeah, illusions. Is being him, just genuinely being him. Now we're gonna go, yeah, yes. <laughs> still, I, uh, I was still right about how the plot is going. <laughs> Yeah, just like hello, nice to meet you, and done. <laughs> That's it.
ジュースを買ってきたんだみんな事務所にいるよ私のこと探しててくれたんですかすみません行き違いになっちゃったみたいですねうんうんリリアちゃんの好みがよくわからなくて僕の好みで選んじゃったけど大丈夫かな<笑>お茶系でしたらどれでも大丈夫ですのでFairy tale.、Uh, yeah, speaking of fairy tale, the last one was a fairy tale. We got no fucking ending there.、Uh... Sorry, <laughs> Nishtemo. Sugoi Kazano in Gildane. Yeah, you just saw this. You didn't realize what it looks like. Doesn't that remind you of anyone special? This is it. Furu Ningyo, the Omoi toka, o Ipai Sui Konder, so this car, eh? Yeah. Onen toka mo a r k a m o ちょっと怖いですよね。そうだね。そういうのもあるかも。ここ、あまりいい感じがしないから。あれ先輩って、オカルトとかわかる人なんですかそういうのじゃないけど。オッケー。でも。Oh, Lord, drop, please. I mean, I mean, just take a look at this, man. I wouldn't call this settle. <laughs> It's very unnerving. Yeah! Well, not really creepy, but they're just so. All of them are just staring at one spot.、Uh, It's kind of kind of spooks you out a little bit. Imi to Sir Pashotte, Bokoa, Arto Munga. Negativity zone must be real. Imi to Sir Pasho. Pitodate, Nagusamir no Hagemas no, Dochiramo, Gakkoka in the Shima Kanjo no Tokite, Arione. 一人にしておいた方がいい時ってやつですね。僕は父さんに場所にもそういうところがあるって教わったことがあるんだ。This is what I t h i n k okay? 父さんはそれを意味とする場所って呼んでたけどね。うん、ネガティブリーゾーン。Mr. ネガティブ。Me。けがれた場所ってわけですね。ラテッドベース。そういう場所には。用事もなく近づかない方がいいですもんねありがとうございます先輩これからは気をつけますねそうだ実は先輩にお渡ししたいものがあってだったら僕にも近づかない方がいいかもねうん僕も汚れてるそうだから。いや
Yeah. That's what bothering him. That's why he's giving you this cold look, yet still being empathetic towards you. Uh, yeah, he has his whole mind. Full of Kurokami right now. We need answers for that bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't be salt of a human anymore. I don't know what the hell is going on. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. He's still trying to find out. さあね。でもさっきのクロカミさんが僕にそう言うんだ。僕は汚れているから二度と近づくな。不幸が訪れるって。<laughs> I don't know, man. Maybe you are that misfortune stuff. I'm sorry. I don't know what to believe anymore. Kurokami-senpai-wa-chot-to-are-desu-ka-ne-so-na-no-o-kini-shinai-ho-ga-i-i-desu-yo. Yes, it is messed up. Thank you for clearing that up. Gome. Just to chase out to say, it's just a joke. It's just a joke. It's just a joke. It's just a joke. Go. みんな待ってるよ。あ、先輩、待ってください。ん実は先輩に。お渡ししたいものがありまして。うん。何？How? <laughs> Okay.
Okay. Yeah, that's... See, I... Yeah, it's, apparently this is like a, a real thing. And, you know, like idol stuff. And I think Korea also have this kind of trend. I don't really get it. I mean, as a, I'm a music lover myself. I know that these things exist, but... There is a limit to the, you know, of how much you can just come up with and uh, Japan and uh, Korea seems to be not keeping counts. Let's try to be the next one, yeah. I understand that. In the entertainment business, yes, I understand that. I just don't under understand the trend that just keep popping up new ones that keep popping over and over. Is doesn't it bore? Is it boring? It's basically the same thing. You don't start to see it's almost too similar. Enough. Nothing actually stands out. That was annoying.
apparently nothing bad is happening here. This is... This is actually pretty... Awesome, actually. <laughs> Off what? Okay. And uh, by chance, you know, the three members have the same hair color of the three girls, and uh, that is key plot point to the story. Oh, 
never thought that he'd be this this annoying. I, I never thought he'd be this this annoying. It's so annoying to you. Respectful. I don't think he will. Maybe he would. He just because uh, if I were him, I won't be in that crowd. You can give me VIP tickets all you want. I'm gonna be outside waiting for it. <laughs> if that's what you want me to come for, I'll be outside. Just like him. Here we go. Lily, chan, muckashi kara dutto ouen shite orimashita zo. Arigato, onii chan, Lily, ureshii yo. Lily chan no koto 
ネットでは劣化したとかなんとか言ってるやからもおりますが僕の中ではマジカルリリーの輝きはええんですぞネットは荒れてるみたいですけど僕はずっとマジカルリリーを応援してますからねリリーちゃんがどんなに変わっちゃっても僕の愛は変わりません劣化とかオワコンとか言われてますけどそんなの気にしちゃダメですよリリー気にしないよだってお掃除の国のプリンセスだもんせーのピカピカマジックでみんなのハートをクリンクリンうわーリリリリリマジカルリリー Internal conflict or something? Trying to put the pieces together here. The situation is happening, the... and then in the dialogue. Wait, concept for looking at someone. I mentioned this on my uh, uh, first art, no, the, uh, first art reaction. That I had start to understand that Suzuha, Suzuhara was has a, uh, his emotions towards Kurokami because it's just that. Little brotherly love, and you start looking at someone, no matter how grown up they are, you still see them as the same image as you met them before, as you know them. Now, is this the perspective? And this one's correct for another perspective. I think what's happening here is really a It's not understanding that that perception of the people that keep calling her Lily, this magical girl Lily, because they still see her as the little girl that they admire and they they care about. And it's not about you know, it's not about love. Ah, this is like a, a different perspective on the things that I thought I know. Ah. Interesting.
ジカルリリーは永遠のお姫様なのあんたなんかどっか行っちゃえ汚い化け物ピカピカマジックでクリンクリーンリリー大丈夫立ちくらみはりきりすぎだよ休んだらありがとうございます握手は誰をご指名なさいますかクルスリリアさんで<笑>スースーだすごい頑張ってたね<笑>君のリリーとは違う新しいクルスリリアをおおぼえしっかり見せてもらったからねいや、ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。てたのかよいやあ夏くんこんなところで会えるとは思わなかったよ。誰目当てで来たんだやっぱリリアちゃんか、うん、マジカルリリーの良さをこれほど短時間で気づくとはさすがスハラグレイトな男だぜ you see? You see, she doesn't see it. That these people who see her as magical Lily is actually looking at her as the new her. But it's not in. Yeah, yeah, do. Gambat it, eh? Dance mo kirik kirik at then, ah! Sasgawa magical Lily does it! Tokoro de sa. Single te, doko de utter no? Ah! お前まだシングル買ってねえのかよあんくらいとリリアちゃんに挨拶していきたくてささっきから迷子になってるんだよすすはらを迷子にさせるとはなこの会場は実にグレイトだぜ俺が案内してやるよこっちだぜあれえこっちだったかなあれあれえっと迷うでしょオーケー。
Okay, you know what? I'm going to save it right here. I'm going to end it here. Because... Yeah, I think I have one more chapter to go. Uh, right now, it's not really ending. Wait, wait. Wrong button. Anyway. And that's it for the day, I guess. I, um... I'm a bit surprised for about almost three hours in. Nothing horrifying is happening and uh, it's actually pretty wholesome. I, I was right about the whole concept of uh, being a, the, this chapter being a light-hearted one. Yeah, then it's not really going the way I thought it was. I fully thought it was, but it, it is alluding towards it. In a way, it is the cliche, you know, I'm gonna make you fall for me for something and then actually you start falling for the guy. You know, it's all leading towards that. Uh, but it is a very an eye opening though. I, I now I have a little small information about the where the doll originate and there is some form of rituals uh, that happens in this town that concerns this doll. So now I have small understanding about that it's just that there's no tight connection to any of these things happening yet you can't seem to tie it in all together but at the very uh, at the very least uh, we got some information and uh, okay then um, with that being said uh, thank you for watching and uh I think I should go find somebody to read. And Madoma says he was about to stream. So let's go see if what he's going to do afterwards. And uh, let's see what he's going to do afterwards. Where are you? Close this thing. And all right.